Hello! Welcome to Thirsty Amigos. Uh, thanks for joining us on this episode. We are going to start our beer cellared series. <laughs> Celery series? Cellared, cel is cellared a word? Cellared, cellared yes. beer cellared. Cel series. Well, that's a tongue twister. Cellared beer series. That's what we're going to do. So, long story short, I have acquired or have a lot of beer that's really old. <laughs> I've <have acquired. laughs> been collecting. Yeah. And it was set up for another um, uh, joint venue thing. I don't know what you want to call it. But anyway, we have a lot of beer that we need to get, go through, and a lot of it's old. On the average, what, six, seven years old, probably? Yeah. Mm -hmm. At least, at least <laughs> yeah. that old. So Hope it's still good. So we're going to start. <laughs> I know. So that, that's what this series is all about. That's what this series is all about. Is this beer, how, how is it held up over the years being cellared? Some of the big beers, you know, 10% and more, are made to be cellared. Yeah. So they can stand the test of time. Some say they get better, some say they round off the edges, some mellow. Anything under 10%, they say, depends. It could just mute the flavor and uh, not, it'll still be beer drinkable, but it may not be very tasty, I yeah. guess. So we're going to find that we're out. We're going to find that out today. And we're actually starting with uh, a beer from Avery Brewing, Puncia. Puncia. Oh, Puncia. Puncia. Um, it's a barrel-aged sour ale is what it is at its uh, core. That sounds good. But it's aged in tequila barrels with prickly pear added, which prickly pear is the Puncia part. That's yeah. Um, okay. It was where they very did. good when it first came out. Yeah, so this is... So Avery, they still doing it today, has a barrel age series. This is number 18. We were just looking, they're at number 60 right now. Wow. So this is number 18. And because of that, this is from, this is bottled on February 19th, 2014. Ooh. So. Seven years old. Yes. And Over seven years old. Yeah. Yeah, in February, yeah, that's right. Huh? Almost, mm -hmm. almost eight. There's only 263 cases uh, produced. And the alcohol volume on this is 6.65. So it's under under 10. So we're going to see <laughs> how this is held up since out. 2014. Um, uh, I do have a bottle opener this time. Thanks, Dominic, for the last couple times. <laughs> see? There we go. Still haven't mastered this one, though. Let's see. Oh, she's uh, okay. Uh, oh. oh. There we oh. go. Yes. Oh. It works. I break the bottle, probably. <laughs> if there's glass chips, I apologize. <laughs> Okay, so let's uh, get this pouring real quick. Ooh, nice Ooh. orange color. Yeah, that right. looks good. Ooh, still some carbonation in here. So I think we're. I think this one's a good one. That. Oh man, I always do that. Somehow get this right. Um, yeah, still a lot of carbonation, which is yeah, good. Um, that's a good sign. So right. for all these beers that in the cellar beer series, um, I've been selling cellar. Oh my gosh, that's good. Cellaring them. <laughs> cellar We're making up words tonight, baby. Uh, cellaring them storing correctly. Them. Storing them. <laughs> They've been in the cellar uh, correctly. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You perfect. perfect. Okay. okay. Product placement. I'll put oh, the good gold job. cap right there. Good there job, go. hey. man. I'm here for you. I'm here You're for on you. you. You're on it. All right, let's smell this. I think it smells really good. It smells tequila smells good. Ooh. I smell the tequila. Oh, that brings back a lot of memories. Dominic, I, mm. Dominic, and I, I can't talk today. Sorry, <laughs> have a lot of experience with this beer. Did you have any uh, when you were hanging around Jeff? Because uh, he had some. He loved the sours in the oh, beginning, yeah. so I probably have had this. Oh, it has a nice. I mean, it smells very good. It has a nice sour yeah, smell. It does. Yeah. yeah, that's really I'm trying to get maybe a little citrus. Like it has like a citrus note. It's hard to put my. Mm -hmm. Could be the barrel. It's got, I it's think the even barrel's got like a, a rose color. Uh, if you look at the edges, yeah, that's the blanket. Look at, look at the studio. <laughs> 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 it's the orange. It's yellow. got a blueberry color. <laughs> There's blue in here too. <laughs> you look at this. Oh crap! <laughs> this is a nice straw color. <laughs> Nice <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, let's, let's, uh, let's try this. It smells really good. Oh, oh yeah. Well, that's sour. That's awesome. Oh, wow. It's good, though. That's All right. held up. That's, yeah. It's a little that's weak, but it's, a little, it's held that, up. That's a you know what I'm, what I'm not finding on here is a lot of the barrel. Right. Yeah. There's not a lot of barrel oak. So, uh, um, I think it said, and it'll be in the... Uh, B footage of I think it's nine months on the side. If you turn the bottle on the side right there, Dominic, I think it says, um, or, or if you want to read it, 
I can't read that small print. Oh, <laughs> I'm not that young. So it says, uh, so number 18 says, really, a sour ale uh, yeah. with a dose of prickly pear and patiently matured in first use small batch tequila barrels for nine months. Hmm. So, so it was in the tequila that's barrels for good. nine months. So that's a, that's that's a good, good chunk of time. I, I haven't yeah. had this in a long time. I know, it's been since you, 2014. You definitely taste the sour <laughs> and the prickly pear. I think the last time I had it was when it came out. Yeah, yeah, prickly so pear is. Yeah, prickly <laughs> pear is like uh, the uh, fruit of a cactus. Mm, that, okay. was, that was too easy. I mean, this is. I mean, this is a true definition of so, a sour beer. So. It is, yeah. It still has the sour component up front. He's making the face. No, I, I, I like it. It, it. it makes you pucker. It, it makes does. you pucker. I do like yeah. it. I it will. It, yeah, it reminds me of the taco beer, a better tasting of the taco oh. beer. No. <laughs> yes, it does. <laughs> this so, is, taco way, beer was down here. Well, yeah, exactly. Here. That's what I'm saying. It's a better I, taste of the yeah. taco beer. I get what you're saying. It had that sour component right off the yeah. front. Yeah. Yeah. Better. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That taco beer. This, <laughs> this is still very... This is held up. It's still good. Yeah, I would drink it. Like, no, so I, I would point it out. Still, a lot of combination. Fact, I'm pour me a little more. Yeah, please. Yeah, I'll, I'll have a little bit more. Too. Oh no, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Wow. <laughs> oh, that's me first. <laughs> <laughs> There's not much left though. All right, so this one has held up. Um, uh, yeah, that's kind of surprising. So if you're accidentally like me holding on to these. Right. They're still good. They're still good. Yeah. yeah. Still, still, yeah. Drink don't up, don't worry. The yeah. It's there. Yeah. I have another one. Maybe in a, you know seven more years. <laughs> we'll, we'll be back. We'll crack that one open. <laughs> I, I say we crack it open after this one. <laughs> yeah. No, it's, yeah. It's not bad at all. I'm no, I'm impressed. I, okay. I enjoy it. It's pretty good. So it has held up. Fact, even at the low in alcohol. In fact, I think this one is the one that got me on sour beers for a while. Yeah. Because I was on a sour beer kick. And I, think I, this I know is our, the one that I know our friend Jeff. He's really big in the sours. Mm -hmm. And he got me on my sour journey. Not that I went very far. But yeah. I still like it's the sour. I appreciate him. Yeah. I appreciate <laughs> yeah. the sours a lot more because of his insight. And this yeah. one really has the sour I think, yeah. component. And it's not off-putting. It's really good. Yeah. It's really yeah. held up. How about the uh, mm. tequila? I, know, I, it's, there's yeah. no I mean, I know it was the barrel. I don't taste the tequila. tequila. Yeah, you guys are more of a tequila people than I, think, I am, but I don't taste any. I think I smell more of the barrel than I taste it. But it still has a, a nice good punch of the mm. sour in your mouth. I like it. All right, cool. My sniffer's broken. <laughs> I, don't, I don't smell no tequila. Yeah. And I'm not, I'm, I'm assuming it was right. a suerte tequila. How many, barrels. how many sombreros after? Oh, so this, uh, this one. So we're, so let's judge it on what it is, how it is now, what it is. Yeah, we're not opening it. We're trying it. Yeah, not because not everyone's had it originally. Seven and a half years later. <laughs> so yeah. I'm gonna. I would give this uh, for me three sombreros. Three. Three for me. Three. Mike. I mean, I <clears throat> I know you're supposed to have some sort of a tequila taste to it, so I don't know. But like I said, I don't think I've ever had this. If I have, it was seven years ago. Yeah, yeah. So I I'd give it four because it really has sour beer. So, uh, boy, pick. you give a five. I originally I would say a five. Yeah, um, the, uh, yeah. But now um, it's still about a four. I think. It's, it, it has held up, but it, originally it was mine. Originally, that was my it favorite. Was, yeah. yeah. Oh, I remember you couldn't get enough of it. Yeah. yeah. I think you bought two hundred cases of this. <laughs> 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 There's a lot. I wish I could. Yeah. Was it like twelve <laughs> bucks of beer or something? And, and knowing that it's held up, it would yeah. have been yeah. You could, right. Fine, Eric. What do you think? I think I'm at. Like I said, it's way better than the taco beer. Way better than the taco beer, but yeah, I, I'm digging the sourness. Yes, I just wish it had more tequila taste to it. So I, I'm gonna say about three and a half. Can I give it three and a half? Three and a half. Oh yeah, we can do half. Remember, I'm gonna do three and a half. We can't do your three quarters and stuff like that. Three point three three. Three. Three and one third. If you can get a third, if you can get a, can I have a little three and one third up here, please? The graphics. You're always testing the graphics department. You're right. Like this guy. All right, three and a half. Three and a half. Yeah, yeah. I'll go with the strong three and a half. It's pretty good. Right. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, it's still good. 
it holds up. It's held up. Success, I think, drink, on this one. Drink it, I, I like it. Yes, This one is yeah, success. Definitely yes. drink it. Yes. First, and the many, many beers that we're going to be tasting that are really, really old. <laughs> <laughs> Not all of them may be good. We'll see. Our kids weren't that's, born yet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, they were. <laughs> they were. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, thanks. Yeah. yeah. Thanks. Okay. And uh, we'll see you guys later. Salute, Emils. Wish I had more. Yeah. I'm empty too. <laughs>